Hey, what's up guys? Ali here from iSocialU.com and welcome back to my channel. In this video today, we're going to talk about how do you find the emails and phone numbers of your leads and prospects from LinkedIn. Before we jump into it, you know what to do. Subscribe, hit the bell icon and also like this video. All right, now let's jump right into this. So first of all, I want to show you the tool that I use uh, for prospecting. So the tool I use to find emails and phone number is called Arrow Leads. Arrowleads.com, here's the URL. And yes, this video is sponsored by Arrow Leads, and I'm a huge fan of this tool. And if you step back, anyone in B2B business, finding emails and phone numbers of your leads and prospects is huge on, on LinkedIn. LinkedIn is our number one tool on the service side of our business, iSocialU, that's the agency that I run. Now, let's look at this tool. It's really, really simple. And basically, here's the, the, the way this tool works. I'll, I'll do a demo in a second. It's a Chrome plugin. So you're going to install in your Chrome. It, it looks like this. And then basically, you go to LinkedIn and you search for whoever you want to reach out to um, for your business. For example, in my case, I want to, let's say I want to connect with founders and CEOs in Dallas, Texas. That's the city I live in. So I can search for those people. And then using this tool, I can find their business emails and also their phone number. It's very simple. And then Arrow Leads manage all the prospects in one place for me. Yes, it is a paid tool. I'm sure you're going to ask that. Um, but if you go to their pricing page, they do have some free credits that you can use. But I want to be upfront. I do use one of their paid plans. So yeah, you can do a free trial or you can do the free credits. But uh, if you do decide to upgrade, uh, here are their pricing. But if you think about this, the, the lifetime value of a lead or a customer, for, for example, in my business, it's huge. When we get a new client on the agency side, but people stay with us for, for months and years to come. So um, spending on tools like this, it makes a lot of sense. Now, let's talk about how do you use this tool. It's actually very simple. So first of all, you know, let's say if once you create an account, you're going to download their Chrome extension and install that Chrome extension. I am actually going to go right inside my dashboard. Ooh, let me go back. I'm already signed in. So I am going to go inside my settings. And then from here, click on prospect. So this is where it's going to store all the data. This is your dashboard. And you can create different lists depending on what type of people you want to uh, reach out to. So for example, I've created lists of uh, DFW Dallas CEOs, Dallas founders. These are the type of people that I wanted to reach out to for my agency services. So for example, if I click on Dallas CEOs, you'll see here are different their names, their companies, and then their, uh, the tool did find their email addresses and then in some cases their phone numbers as well. Now, if you want to create a list, it's very easy. You'll just come here, click on new list, and then you can enter a name. So I don't want to create a list right now. I already have two. Now, let, let me show you how to do or find the phone numbers and emails on LinkedIn. And um, do make sure you install the extension. So you'll click on this and the in, install the extension, uh, Chrome extension. I already have it, which is right here. So tiny, tiny the rocket. That's the Chrome extension. Now let's go to LinkedIn and let's say I'm doing a lead generation. I want to reach out to entrepreneurs and CEOs in Dallas, Texas. So I'll just search for uh, their title CEO and then we're going to click on people. In my case, since I'm based in Dallas, Texas, I want to reach out to people in Dallas, Texas, but it's totally up to you. You can go global or just United States. So let's say I want to reach out to people who are second degree connections and live in Dallas, Texas. Hit apply. There you go. So these are the people that I am interested in reaching out to. So they are, they are CEOs and they live in Dallas, Texas. Very cool. Now, if you look on the top, see this Chrome extension early? It's, it show, it's already actually detecting these people. It knows that I'm on a, on a search page where I have different list of different people that I want to find their emails and phone numbers for. So the next step is I'll just click on this extension and it's going to tell me or right here, give me an option to add these people to the list. So 
do make sure if you have multiple lists, do make sure you, you select the right list. For example, Dallas uh, DFW CEOs, that's good. And if you want to create a new list, I believe you can create it from here as well. So if I want to add these people, I'll just start, you know, I can do one by one or I can just hit add all. And then see how now it's adding these people to my list and then also finding their phone numbers, emails, uh, or both if possible. So once these people are added, so see how it's finding the, the email addresses? It's great. So let's go back. And then we're going to refresh this. And yes, so it did find, added some new people to my list. So it was 10 and now it's 18. So it found like eight new people. And yes, see how I'm able to see their email addresses and also the phone numbers. Very cool. So here's the email addresses and also the phone number. So that's it, guys. This is how we use arrow leads to find phone numbers and emails of the right people on LinkedIn so we can uh, reach out to them and potentially do business with them. If you have any questions, leave those questions below in the comments. And also before you go, make sure you subscribe, hit the bell icon, and also like this video. And I'm going to see you in the next one. Bye for now.